All right, another strategy of um, adding and subtracting numbers is what we called estimate or um, estimating. So one way of estimating is this way, okay? Let's say uh, we have here um, the, pet, uh, the pet households, okay? So the table shows the results of a survey by the North Adams Animal Shelter about how many people have either dogs or cats, but not both. So one way of estimating this is um, using rounding. Okay. So we're going to estimate 34,221 plus 38,899. So, um, we're going to round each number to the nearest thousands. So, for 34,221, this will be 34,000 because 2 is less than 5. And for 38,899, since 8 is uh, 5 and above, so we can round it up. We can round it off, so 38 will become 39,000. So add all this up, the sum is 73,000. So, so there's about 73,000 people have either dogs or cats. Remember, when you hear the word about, about gives you an idea that that you are not expected to write the exact answer so you only need to estimate next another way is using the front end estimation so the first one is rounding to the nearest thousand and this time is front end estimation so with front-end estimation, you're going to add the value of the front digits. So let's use the same numbers. 34,221 plus 38,899. So remember, we're only adding the value of the front digits. So the value of the front digits are 30,000 and 30,000 so that makes, makes it easier to add so that's a total of 60,000 so there's about 60,000 people have either dogs or cats so for you which way rounding or front-end estimation do you think gives an estimate that is closer to the actual sum So what do you think? So when subtracting, you could also use um, estimation and, of course, using rounding and front end estimation could also be utilized, right? So how do we do it with subtraction. So let's say we want to estimate 86,017 86, minus 35,572. So we need to round it off to the nearest 10,000. So to the nearest 10,000. So this is the 10th uh, thousands place and the 10th thousand place which since 6 is um, 5 is bigger than 5 so um, we can round this off to 90,000 and 35 we round it up to 40,000 so 90,000 minus 40,000 is equals to 
50,000. So the difference is about 50,000 when we use rounding. Okay? So if we use front end, what we have to do, front end, remember, we're only getting the value of the front number. So that would be 80,000 minus, we get the value of 30,000. So if we subtract that, it is 80 minus 30 is 50,000. So this way, it's about the same as when you round it or when you use front end estimation. So once you have found an estimate, you can adjust it to make it closer to the actual sum or difference. Okay, let's more examples. Let's say 7,593 minus 3,145. Okay, I'd like you to try this in your journal using rounding and um, using front end estimation. Okay, so if you use rounding, let's round this off, let's say, to the nearest thousand. So, this would be 8,000, and this would be 3,000. So, your answer would be 5,000. If you use front end estimation, it will be 7,000 minus 3,000, that will give you 4,000. So, you'll be able to get the closer estimate to the exact answer. Okay, got it?